Welcome on my YouTube channel or on our YouTube channel better to say. So, dear friends, uh, as I usually say, this is the case when I must buy it. Uh, these boxes arrived about 30 minutes ago together with uh, some turntables and other uh, audio, old audio which I love. And why, <laughs> why I must buy it? Uh, I will explain it, uh, explain it uh, later. Uh, at first I would like to thank you for watching our videos, for sub subscribing our YouTube channel. And if you like our videos and if you would like to support our channel, you can also join our channel. So back to these boxes, uh, these are, I can say, the legendary uh, Tesla ARS 9, 3, 4 or 8. The last number means impedance and I, up to now, I don't know, uh, don't know <coughs> if there are uh, 3 or 4, uh, four or 8 ohms. Uh, here is a label, but uh, back, back. Packed. I cannot see it and here's the label missing. I try to uh, cut out this knife, uh, this foil uh, to check the type because uh, if I don't uh, read the label and if I don't put down put, uh, this front grill, I don't know if there are two way or three way because the dimension and the <laughs> outfit is uh, from uh, outside uh, is the same like by the legendary Tesla ARS uh, 944 or 948. They are three way. I give here, uh, if I don't forget, active link to the uh, ty uh, type uh, 944 and uh, they look uh, so, so there is uh, uh, 203 millimeters uh, mid-range speaker or full-range speaker connected as a mid-range and in front of, oh, I can do it, so, so here is uh, by the uh, type 944 uh, such a full-range as a mid-range and in front of uh, this speaker is such a uh, tweeter coaxial mount and this is the best way how to mount car how to mount the tweeter in front of the uh, mid-range speaker. Uh, I love the sound of uh, this type of uh, speaker boxes. So, two-way. And uh, back to the history. Uh, these boxes and uh, also the uh, 944 uh, were produced uh, in early, or the production started early 80s. And uh, there are, uh, I can say, smaller version and cheaper version of the legendary Tesla ARS 844 or 840. Uh, if I forget, I put here also Active Link. Uh, and there are bigger ones. And uh, <coughs> Watch my, watch my previous video, the 844 are the, uh, for my ears the best ones uh, or the best hi-fi Tesla boxes ever made but uh, a lot of uh, or the most of uh, hi-fi fans from Czech Republic or Slovak Republic or from the past Czechoslovakia will not agree with, uh, with me, they should prefer the newer types but for my ears I love the 844 or 840. <laughs> I have my home cinema upstairs with the 840. They are super, super. So now we know that uh, these boxes are uh, 8, uh, uh, 934 or 938. So let's take it from the, from the foil. I prepared here my cables. I forgot that uh, <laughs> there are cables connected, so no problem. I don't need to lose uh, my cables, but I can show you. Uh, it's also interesting from the back side. Uh, this is, uh, <coughs> uh, I can say, classic. Tesla speaker boxes terminals. Uh, there, is uh, there is possible to connect by three way uh, cables. S now connected, normal wires 
and the screws or nuts on the on the screws. Uh, the second possibility is to use the banana plugs. Every, everybody knows. Click. Click. Connected. Or here is the <coughs> two pin speaker connector. This one is here on the other, other, other end. So connected. <coughs> So uh, for me, very nice and very interesting. And for the testing here, uh, the most quick way is uh, to use the banana plugs, but not the best, but the most great. All right, let's open them from the, we've opened the uh, next box and uh, we'll see the label. Disconnected and the label is not in good condition and uh, I cannot read it. So 934 4 ohm, perfect. 934 4 ohm, uh, we can check it because sometimes <laughs> coming here the boxes the same but but with different different impedance so let's check it four ohms super four ohms super <coughs> so it's uh, always uh, i'm always disappointed when uh, coming here the same pair of boxes with different impedance so now i will use i will use the my cable and let's try it so connected <laughs> at first I have to watch the speakers okay as uh, <laughs> as you can see hundred years dust but okay Okay, it should be cleaned. Let's play the music. Left channel. Right channel. Are you interested what's inside? <laughs> Let's see what's inside. Uh, there should be, if I say it correctly, uh, the uh, Twitter Tesla ARV161 uh, forums and uh, the bus speaker uh, will be or should be Tesla ARM665 uh, with plastic cover on the magnetic system. So let's uh, clean the dust and then I will <coughs> open or I will take out the bus speaker and to watch the, I <coughs> would like to record or to show you the crossover there should be crossover with, with huge coils here on these two screws uh, I will not uh, dismount it, uh, the crossover from the box but I will take camera and make uh, footage uh, of the inner parts but at first let's clean them So now it looks much more, much more better. Let's open them. Let's watch what's inside better in this position. Ah. 
not so simple. So, as I told before, Tesla ARN665 with the plastic cover of the magnet. Okay, I will try to put them in other position. Pink material, it's a cotton, real cotton. Ah, here is the crossover, but I'm sure that you cannot see it. I will have to take camera closer and inside the inside the box. So, dear friends, uh, what do you think about these boxes? Do you like the crossover? Do you like the speakers? Do you like the sound? Write me in comments. <laughs> I must say, I love it. So, such a old Tesla speakers. So, thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing our YouTube channel. And if you like our videos, you can also join our channel. So, have a nice day. Thank you.